easy to feel like you're not getting as much enjoyment out of life. Perhaps you've lost that childlike wonder. But we're going to talk about what we can do about that, and we're going to talk about it starting right now. Hi guys, my name is Carl, and welcome back to SMA. Here we discuss the issues, build connections, and inspire the lives for those of us who are going through middle age. Right now, I am here in Melbourne Beach, Florida, overlooking the beautiful Intercoastal Waterway. If you're not a sailor, the Intercoastal is a place that people like to go so that they can sail along the coast and not have to be out in a lot of open water. It's a really beautiful thing, and in fact, I think you might even be able to see a sailboat out there right now. I am here on vacation with my family. Unfortunately, it's a rather blustery day today, so I'm hoping that the wind muff will take care of most of this wind and that you'll be able to hear me. Something I've discovered on this trip, or something I've thought about on this trip, is how my kids view the world. We have made several stops on our way down here. We drove down, we stopped in Rock City in Georgia, although at first we thought it was in Tennessee, so we went way out of our way, and then had to drive two hours the other direction. We also stopped at the Atlanta Aquarium and uh, we did SeaWorld. And in each of these things, I got to see something through my children's eyes. So in Rock City, there's this place where you can look out over seven different states at the same time. It's way up high in the mountains, it's really cool. And my, seeing my kids look at that was something special. Uh, at the aquarium. The kids got to see whale sharks, and oh my gosh, my seven-year-old Jordan, she was so excited about that. You could just see the joy in her eyes. Dad! What? Wait, it is a whale shark! Whale shark! Video and you have to yes. keep on following it. Um, and it was so amazing to be able to, to see that through her eyes, experience that. In SeaWorld, we got to see you know, the, the orcas, we got to see the dolphins, um, and then we got to ride roller coasters. And for my kids, particularly for my seven-year-old, that roller coaster experience is something special. She loved it. And being able to experience that with her, to, to have the joy, they had a ride, Journey to Atlantis. We rode this thing five times because that's what Jordan wanted to do. She wanted to watch this, or experience this over and over and over again. So this was really great. I was really excited to do this, but it gets me thinking about my own life and how, you know, I can spend my time in places doing this, you know, staring at my phone. Which, by the way, my phone was on and I'm killing my battery. Woohoo! And so I can sit there and I can stare at my phone and I can lose track of the things that are going on around me. And that's, a, that's sad. I don't want to lose that sense of wonder. And I think as I get into middle age, it's important that I work on that and try to be better at not losing that. Try to take in the things that are around me. And look at this. This is a, a beautiful spot out here. A fisherman, you got beautiful flowers, right? Try. What I need to do is I need to have a, more of a childlike wonder. I need to live in the moment, experience the things as they do. And as I do that, maybe I will get a little bit more enjoyment out of life. Maybe I will have more experiences that mean more things to me and I can build more connections with my kids and thing and connections with people who are around me and I think that would be a really special thing if I could do that so my challenge to you your homework this week is to go out and try to find um, find something beautiful something exciting and and see it through a child's eyes don't see it through somebody who's in their 40s and like yeah I kind of been around I've been to amusement parks I've seen beautiful things whatever right try to experience that as a kid would experience that let that joy kind of go through you so that you can be more like a child and less like an old person like me right and then let me know down in the blah blah below how that's going for you and I'll see if I can't comment on it um, right now I'm gonna get back to enjoying some time with my family you guys have a great day. Thanks for joining me. We'll see you on the flip side. See you next week. Same bad time, same bad channel.